Hey everyone, North Central here. Thanks for tuning in. This is going to be a video response to Do Dokendo Discimus 73. And I hope I pronounced that right, brother. Uh, it's been a long time since I've been in any type of Latin class. But in his video, Car EDC, he went through the center console of things that he put in uh, for everyday carry in his car and his console. So we're going to jump right to it and get right into it. <clears throat> First up is the Maxpedition M1 waste pack, and I have a whole slew of things in here. I do have a video out on the contents of this that I keep, so if you're interested in that, you can go check that out on my channel. Um, I always have this with me, either it's in the car or on my belt. Um, most of the time it's on my belt, I am um, out and about somewhere that I'm not normally out and about at, or in the woods or something like that. Um, I don't usually carry it uh, while I'm at work because it, uh, I have so many other things that are on my belt anyways, but it is in my car in case I would need it. So the M1 waste pack. Um, next, just a pill sorter, uh, you know, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, you know, one week worth of sorted pills. Uh, this is uh, my medication that I, uh, that I take and I keep it in here fully stocked. Um, just in case I forget to take my medication in the morning, I can always get this or if I'm stuck out somewhere at least I have seven day supply worth next up just some hand sanitizer um, you know hand sanitizer is pretty self-explanatory but you know it has a slew of other things that you can do with it so I keep some of that in here a extra magazine or clip for uh, my concealed weapon A map, uh, you know, I use Google Maps too, and but you know, you don't always get signal where some of the places that you go, so I like to have a hard copy of a map and of course a pen. Uh, these are clips and wires to a car inverter that I got. It's a 400 watt inverter. Uh, you can either plug it into your cigarette lighter or you can use these clips here and take it out and hook it up to your straight to your battery. The cigarette lighter only goes up to about 140, 150 watts. It is a 400 watt. So if you do more than that, you're going to blow the fuse on your cigarette lighter, which I have done. So if I need more juice than what the cigarette lighter can provide, I clip it to the battery with this. But I keep the inverter up underneath the passenger seat. Uh, just because number one it's too big to fit in here and number two it's a great spot underneath the seat to keep it if I need it I just pull it out next I just have a small sewing kit uh, pretty cheap just a couple bucks um, you know I can't think of how many times I've gone to work and had a button pop off my shirt and I just sit down take my shirt off and sew a button right back on it with this uh, it's coming uh, pretty handy and of course I just have a rubber band to keep it closed A deck of playing cards, uh, you know, sometimes I go out of town and, you know, you get tired of watching TV or whatever else and, you know, you, you, sometimes you need help, you know, keeping a conversation with yourself, so some playing cards. Uh, just a pack of facial tissue or uh, tissues, um, so. Next, I keep some baby wipes. You know, you, you, baby wipes are great. You know, they're not just for your bum, but uh, if you were having to spill something in your seat and you sop it up, you know, it gets sticky, especially if it's pop or juice or something, use this to wipe it up. If you need to wipe your hands off or something, you could use this. Uh, so, baby wipes. Uh, just another pack of uh, tissues, and this one's actually about half empty. Okay, uh, some uh, toilet paper to go um, with a pull, little pull-out dispenser-like thing. Uh, these are you get these for uh, for your cars or for camping or stuff like that. Um, kind of rough on the bum, but uh, they do the trick. So keep some of this in here because you just never know when you might need to go. Next, uh, this is a plug-in charger uh, for my iPhone that I have. And I keep one in my house, and of course I keep one in the car. Um, I also have it hooked up to the uh, charger here for the cigarette lighter. Uh, but if I have to go into a building and, and talk on the phone to somebody uh, about, about something, then I can take this in, plug it into an outlet, and charge my phone while I'm doing it. Next. 
Next, just some 550 cord. I believe this is 15 feet, uh, 16 feet of paracord. I did have a green and black in here, but they're being used on another project right now. So I threw this in here. Uh, this is a blaze orange, so it's it's pretty good for for emergency situations. You know, it's pretty easy to see. So, 15, 16 feet of paracord. And of course, I have my uh, work phone charger that I keep in here because the plug-in's in here. So there's always that. I don't normally charge it in here, but um, if I need it, it is here. And let's see. And that's that's all that I have in here. So that's all that I keep in here. Uh, pretty uh, pretty simple, you know. Keep it simple, stupid. Um, I do want to make a note that. I keep a lot of other things in the car that are in my get home bag, as well as things that are in the back seat, you know, behind the seats and things. Um, I keep, uh, you know, anywhere between 12 to 24 bottles of water, uh, you know, three or four days of food, extra clothes, shoes, things of that nature. Uh, you just never know. So that's pretty much it. Hope this helps. Uh, kudos to you, uh, Dokendo Discimus 73, for, for doing the video on it. Uh, it's been a lot of fun. Appreciate it. And until next time, this is North Central. Thanks for watching.